Hi everyone. So welcome to this video. Now as you can see from the title I am going to start doing my planning again. Now I still don't have an actual happy happy planner to be honest guys I just haven't had a chance to look at it. I haven't been out. The last one that I got years ago was from Hobbycraft but when I was up at Hobbycraft um, in Livingston up the, they've actually moved the paper craft stuff up the same it's just a wee tiny section now they've got a cricket bit and then a wee, ho uh, a wee paper craft bit but literally it's so small so they mustn't have been selling a lot of that down the stair is all like your um sewing your knitting and everything so yeah and like kids crafts and christmas crafts so i'll have a wee look at the one in glasgow the next time i'm through it see if i can get a happy planner but i'm going to start it in this one because it's as good as any um and yeah it's more of a tra traveler's notebook but i'm going to turn it into a planner so, if you've seen my wee haul um, oh, a few days ago, I got this one from Hobbycraft. So I'm going to do. I'm going to start doing my plan with me every week again because I really enjoyed that, and I know a lot of you guys had subscribed to me because of that. So, some of you might enjoy this. What I've done is downloaded this um, and printed it out. I used to use these all the time. It's the VictoriaThatcher.com. Now. You can print these onto sticker paper and print them out with your Cricut and I maybe will do that but I just haven't done it yet um, for this week because I'm really desperate to get, start trying it. So yeah, got this. Um, I'm going to use this one. Um, this one says the printable was downloaded for free. It is not re it is not to be reproduced or redistributed physically or via the internet for financial gain. This is for personal use only. So she does this. She's got lots of them on her site, and I will link that in the description box if you're interested in using any of these. So I'm going to use this, cut them out, and we will put them in the planner. I do have my journal of our sticker eh, sticker stamp set that I got. So we'll use some of that as well. And I've got a couple of other bits, like a couple of sprays and inks and things like that. Because I like to do a wee bit of different in my planner. I don't just, like, a lot of people just like getting the planner kits and putting them in. And that's fine if that's absolutely what you do. Sometimes I will do that. Um, but yeah, so this week we're going to go with this. So, I don't know. Oh, it's called It's Fall, y'all. <laughs> Quite cool. And I thought it was appropriate because we are now into autumn. So let's open it up. And... Now I think, let's have a wee look, the first one that I'm going to use is the plain one, so I'll take this out and I'm going to swap it, just because I like using the plain one, just with this kit anyway, and just because I'm going to do some inking and stuff, we'll use that. So, we'll use this one first of all, so we'll just take it out pop that to the side i'm really excited guys i actually got um if you can see some stuff on my desk here i got my new sewing machine yesterday so i have started doing some more sewing i'm going to do a sewing themed journal so i started doing that okay so notebook let's see i want to do a double page i probably will do something on here like my name or you know something like that just make this a bit easier to work with so we'll do a double spread so first of all what i'm going to do let me just make sure i'm in frame and i'll zoom in a wee bit so you can guys see a wee bit better what i'm doing is i am going to cut out that sheet obviously because i said i've not made it actually it would have been really handy just to put that on his stickers but yeah I haven't done it yet, but I will do it the next time. But anyway, what I'm going to do first of all, just so that this part is drying before I start the cutting out part, is I'm going to do my stamping and my spraying. So we'll do this first of all. So these week plan with me videos, I'm just going to do them every week and I'm going to make them chatty. It probably will be every single Thursday because that's the day, the first day that I'm off work. And I like to do, when I am doing my planning, I like to do it the week, for the week ahead. So... Let's see how I'm going to plan this out. And I don't really usually have, like, I don't go in with, a like, an idea as such. Um, I kind of just wing it, and I like doing that. I'll try and find my old planner that I had just to show you guys. I've had lots of different stuff in it um, from, like, painting and all kinds of things. So, yeah, we'll play it by ear. So, we're going to do the days of the week. So, I'll just do my wee Monday. Um, and I'll go through, like, when I'm doing, I'll like at this bit, I'll just basically talk you through what I'm going to do. And then when I'm doing my actual planning, 
I usually do like talk a wee bit about what I'm going to do that week and I'll write a few things in it. So there is me Monday. Let me just get a wipe. Quite cool, they be stamped. I just wear acrylic ones and these were really cheap, but they're actually not bad. So that's good. And then, oh, I'll put that on the wrong way. Help if I put it on the right way. Monday. And then I want to leave a wee bit of space. So if we do Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Maybe I could even do Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday because I don't really do a lot of my work days and then I could have a bigger space for the weekends. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Or we could do Monday. Yeah, no, we will. We'll do it like that. So we'll do Monday. We'll go on Tuesday about there. It's fine. We will do Wednesday. This is quite fun, actually. I know the Happy Planners are really fab because they're all like lined out and everything for you. Um... I always got the one that didn't have the day on it, so I would have to do this anyway. So I quite like this. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Let me just take the excess off there. Wednesday. Aye, we'll have Thursday on here as well. Why not? We'll go Thursday. Okay. And I might give... Thursday just a wee bit extra here and then just different yeah because sometimes on a Thursday with it being my first day off like because I work Monday like my first week I do Monday Tuesday Wednesday half eight in the morning until eight at night and then I do so that yeah so sorry I've lost my train of thought there Monday Tuesday Wednesday I do half eight until eight and then I'm off Thursday Friday and I'm in on the Saturday half eight till six off on the Sunday the next week I do Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, half eight, to, eh, sorry, yeah, half eight till eight, and then I am on off for four days, so Monday, I eh, can't speak today, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I'm off, so basically I'm four days off this week, I'm on three days, I'm off two, on one, off one, on three, off four, so it's quite good, it's actually quite good shift, long, like the, the 12 hour shifts are long, but it makes up for it when you're getting your four days off, so. Oh, I've put that Friday up there. I was going to be fresh space for the Thursday. Oh, well, it'll no matter. It'll no matter. I'll put a wee bit down here for notes. And if I do need to add anything, I'm going to fold this over just to make this easier to stamp. We'll put a wee bit in for notes if we need to. Saturday. And Sunday. I'll just put Sunday there. And then... Have I got a bit that says notes on here? Nope. That's alright, I'll just write notes myself. Okay, so I'll leave that there now. Get my fingers a wee clean because I've got ink on them. Um, right, let's see. So that's the days in. Okay. Pretty cool. Is there a note? Is there anything that says notes on here? We'll make something. Right, okay. So what we'll do... Let me just get a pen. See that this pen works. Yep. Leave a space for Sunday and then I'll put a bit here. This pen is very good. I got these pens. Uni pen. I think these were from Hobbycraft. I tell you, they didn't last very long. Because I was, you know, fine liners. I was doing, like, fake um, stitching and stuff. And the actual nibs themselves didn't last very long. And then the ink doesn't seem to be as good. But hey-ho. They're cheap enough to pick up a few wee black liners. Fine liners. Right. So I'm just making that a wee bit thicker. There we go. Notes. That'll do. Actually, I want to make that a wee bit thicker, just to make it kind of tie in a wee bit. Notes. Okay, and then I'm going to, at the side of the Thursday, and instead, so basically all the days of the week, I'm just going to put three dots, because I think it looks nicer. Like that. Sunday. 
and then I think we will take I'm going to go with three different coloured pens just as kind of matching um, right we'll go with these colours so these are what's this one soft suede terracotta and old olive so basically just a sort of orangey a green and a brown just because to tie it in with the sheet itself and under the Monday I'm just going to go in with the thicker side so like a sweet bullet a brush tip sorry and just put the line then we'll go with the green Tuesday Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and notes. There we go. I like that, that's pretty cool. Right, okay, now what I'm going to do next is I've got a stencil here. You can see the state of it. I've been using it <laughs> a lot. This is my favourite, favourite, favourite stencil. And look, it has got glitter on there. It's sticky, it's inky. It's got um, Nouveau Mousse. But yeah, I love it. It's one of my favourites. Well, it is my favourite. I'm just going to grab some Vintage 4. And we'll just do a wee bit of random stenciling. Just light, not too heavy. Because obviously we're going to be writing on this. And I'm just going to do three bits on each side. There we go. Cool. So I like that. And then I'm going to go in. I've got these prism glimmer mists. I've got tangerine dream and apple green. Give that a wee bit of a shoot. Again, I'm not going to put much at all on this. I'm just going to do couple the wee drops I'm not even going to re-dip it back into the, the bottle just take what's off there and then with the apple green again this just kind of ties like my back sheet in and these are really nice they'll like dry really glimmery I don't know if you can see that but can you see it on there? Got the green, it's really glimmery. It's, they're beautiful, they dry really nice. They are what they say on the tin light. The glimmer mist is fab. Let me just take it in a wee bit more. There we go. Right, okay. What I'm going to do then is cut out this sheet and then we'll come back and we'll start decorating. It just gives it a wee chance to dry. Okay, so I have cut everything out. Why have I got a flashing on there? What is flashing? Can you see that? Looks like something's flashing there. I don't know what that is. Let me just take that over there a wee bit. Oops. Do you know what I think it is? I think it's just the light itself over there is too bright. I don't know whether it would be worth turning that off. Wait and I'll see. See what it's like. Is that going to make the video too dark? Eh. It's not even. Oh my gosh, really setting back. Is that still flashing? Two seconds, guys. We'll go with that. I think it's just because it's during the day and I've got that other light on. It's just too bright and it's making the camera flash. Right, any key, any key, anyway. <laughs> what I've done, oh, I'm so happy about doing these wee planner videos. Do you know that? I'm, I forgot how much I missed doing them. Right, okay, sorry if you can hear that magpie out there. So I've cut everything out now. The only thing I'm not going to use is there was a wee leaf. So I'm not going to use that because it was just fiddly cut out. And there's a banner here that says Happy Fall, y'all. Well, I'm not going to use that, guys, because I'm in Scotland and we say um, autumn instead of fall, okay? So I'm not going to use that one. Right. All these wee fiddly bits out the way. 
So let's decide. So what I think I'm going to do is there is one here that says autumn. Okay. So I'm going to put that right at the very top. I'm just going to use my normal pin flare glue for this. So we'll go with autumn. Just doesn't need much to go. This is just copier paper. When I used to do this, I used to um, print them out on card. But my printer now, I've got the... It's actually a new printer that I've got. It's the EcoTank 2720. I used to have the, two, the, the ET 2700. But it's the E720 that I've got now. Um, I've got a new one, so my other one, I upgraded it basically. Um, and it does need to do card. But because it's an EcoTank, it's amazing for printing out my journals and like sticker sheets and everything. So, yeah. But it does say, like on Victoria's um, site, it does say print it out on good copier paper or sticker paper, like sticker sheets. And she actually gives you the instructions on how to do it on your, um, how to do it on your Cricut. So that's good. So you've got these three wee guys. I think I'm going to turn one of these into a paper clip because I always like to try and do a paper clip. Not with every spread, but I do like to do them with some. And just because this is my first one and I'm excited to do it, I think I will. Right, so what does this say? Fall breeze and autumn leaves. Well, it does say autumn on it, so I'll have that. Quite like it. That's quite nice. So I'll put that up in the corner. Just to decorate it there. Got a bit of glue that's annoying me on that. There we go. Okay. We've got these wee boxes. Do you want me a wee robin on it? I'll show you this up close like I did, like I used to, as soon as I've done it, I'll bring it right up close to the camera and show you. So under Monday, we're going to go with a wee box. I don't know how many boxes there is here, but we'll fill in a few. One, so many as there, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we'll put one under Tuesday. This one says, Little Miss Thankful. So, there we go. That's just because um, Victoria is American. Um, but yeah, it's cool that she does this. She's got a big business with her husband. And then she does, she's also got like a store on Etsy where you can buy some of your sheets. And then she does on her um, website all these free ones for us. So yeah, they're really cool. So I'm just putting in those. Here. And a lot of the time when I do these planning me's, you'll see me coming on and using like my own sticker sheets. Um, like just ones that I've actually made and that I'll sell in my Etsy or ones that I've got in the, just in my stash and things like that. Because I use all different things. This one says happy fall y'all. So what I'm going to do is just cut it there like that. It's got a nice wee squirrel, same squirrel as that. So I'll take that off and he can go in there. These are nice easy boxes because it means you can just put in like wee notes for that day. Put that there. Notes. And then I'm going to put in, I'm going to keep the fox and we'll make him into a paper clip. So we'll have this wee owl. Now I did cut his feet off when I was fussy cutting him because it was a bit of a pest to fussy cut. So I'll go back in and draw his wee feet in for him. Or his wee claws or what do you call them? I will see, I will claws, claws. <laughs> so it was just two wee feet that came out like this. So I'll just go in and put them on just so that he doesn't look like he's standing on fresh air, just like that. Okay, so here we go. Put this wee one here. Where can we put this wee dude? Here. Hi. That's quite sweet. And I know there is supposed to be like places, a lot of people, you'll get the planning channels and they're really like, you're supposed to put this here and you're supposed to put this there for the kits, but I think, I just like putting them anywhere. I think just doing your Amy spread looks nice. Now I've got one here that says Hello Autumn. So we could put that, actually, I like these boxes as well. Look, be thankful because you can write on these ones. Put this one in. Put them in a bit there. Be thankful. 
beautiful. Of her Palu Autumn. And this is the box one. Again, I'll show you up close once I've done it, guys, but I just really want to get everything put in place. Hello, Autumn. There's these wee banners, but I don't know if I'm going to use any of these. They are really sweet, but I don't know if I'm going to use them. Maybe. Actually, I might put one there. That's quite nice. Just to bring a wee bit of colour. I'll use this one. Yeah, you don't have to feel like, sometimes obviously we feel like we need to use everything when we cut everything out and stuff, but it's like, you know what, it's your page, you do it how you like it. We've got that one there, the only other wee things I've got left is these banners. I'll put this one. It'd be nice if some one of these was like horizontal. Put that one there. I don't think I'm going to bother with the Hello Autumn Yeah, I don't think I'll bother with that and I'll put this wee one on here Okay I think we're actually alright, we've practically used the whole sheet just a couple of wee silly bits that we didn't use well not silly bits but you know what I mean, the extra bits We'll put that on there Okay, so I like that, that's a pretty cool wee spread We'll take this bit out Oh, he's nice with the fox on him. <laughs> I like him um, with the fox and the apple, but I've not really got anybody to put them. Nah, we'll not fussed. We'll leave the bits out. Right, so that's that. Before I write in it, what I'm going to do is make a wee paper clip. So, we shall do that. Oh, we've got a wee bit of card. Eh, no cards, sorry, my glue gun. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to believe that. Like, I've got my, I, I bought a, I, I got a new glue gun, okay? Because my other one kept leaking and leaking, like the glue all the time, it was wasting a lot. Now, I've got it, have it for a wee while. I was using it the other day. Usually have it plugged in right next to my desk. I can't find it. So what I've had to do is use my other one. <laughs> Honestly, how can you lose like a glue gun? How is that even possible? Oh, I'll just get up sometimes. Right, I'm just putting some glue onto the back of the wee fox. And I'm just going to stick them onto a bit of card. Just to give them a wee bit of stability. Like that. This is 300 GSM card, so it's really thick. I'll take them off of there. And let's cut them out. These scissors are really that good actually. I'll get my Fisker scissors. These are better for fussy cutting. I'll cut them out. I always make a funny face when I'm fussy cutting. I feel like my face is going to the side. It's like my concentration face. Right. Oh, he's a cool wee dude. His whiskers. Definitely I'm going to, when I do the, the spread next week, I think what I'll do beforehand is go onto the Cricut and make them into stickers. So I'll just follow what it is that she says on her site and I'll see if I can make the sticker sheet, which should be easy enough. Just be like making normal stickers, so I can't see this. I think I'll just cut half his tail off. That's alright, that'll do. Right, so we've got our wee fox. I'm just going to take my ink and just go around them a wee bit just to add a wee bit of definition so that you can't see as much of that white 
align the card. Now his tail's a wee bit thin, so what I'll need to do is reinforce it with the paper clip, I think. We'll use that to put the paper clip behind him. Okay, so there he is. Show you. <laughs> Ta-da! Fox. So, let's choose a paper clip. Now, I've got all my wee bits and pieces, and most of them organised. I don't think there's any orange paper clips in here, but I think we'll go with a green. I kind of get that it's fall, y'all, out of my head. <laughs> it's fall, y'all. I love it. I don't know why we call it autumn and they call it fall, but anyway. Right. It's looking good. It's looking cute. I like it. But yeah, let's see. So we'll put the paper clip. These are big, huge paper clips. Maybe that's too big for them, actually. Or maybe, actually, that's a good idea. What we could do with this wee guy is put them onto a circle. That's what I'm going to do. Just because his tail's quite thin. Hope it cuts through this 300. Hope it does. There's one, two. So I'll show you. What did that other one go? I don't know. It's gone. It's vanished into the craft room abyss. Same as my glue gun. There we go. Right, again, just put them together. Put some ink. And up. And we can do another one too. Let's get a bit of definition. There we go. is going to go on there. I just was a bit worried about that tail because the way that it was cut I think wouldn't have lasted very long. So if we put them onto here we can just have these wee ears sticking over the edge like that. That's cute and then we'll have because it's such a big paper clip as well we can have a paper clip like that. That's better. I like that better. Right, let's see if this has warmed up yet, because this, as I say, is the older one. Oh, it has. Look, I used to leave this on all the time. That's why the glue looks burnt. Look at that. I almost left it on for 28, in fact, 48 hours. I know, honestly, it's such a fire hazard, but luckily, it didn't go on fire. Right, okay. Let's see. Take that off. I'll find my new one once I came off the video. I just couldn't be bothered looking for it. There, I just wanted to get this done. So I'll just put a blob on the end. And then straightening this wee guy up on there. He's cute. Like that. And then my other circle. I'll just put another blob in the middle. Line it up and push it down. Like that. Oh, that's cute. I'll just go in the back here and a wee bit of ink just to tie it in. And you can even go over with your brush and just make it a wee bit colour. There we go. So, that's my wee fox guy. He's super cute. Right, let's see. Now, I'm going to have a blue pen. So, what am I doing? Let's think. Monday. So, Monday will be. So, Saturday's the second, Sunday's the third, Monday's the fourth already. My daughter's birthday on the 6th actually. So Monday and that is the 4th of the 6th, uh, 21. And then I am a working and I'm on site with them in the office. We are, and I'm on from, I'll just put in my hours here, 8.30 till 8. 
him. And we are getting a Chinese in work. Although I think I'm just going to take it because we can take in your own food if you want because my BS plays up the Chinese. But anyway, that's for that day. Um, do I need to remember anything else for Monday, 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 Monday? I don't think so. Look at this, this glue gun. This is why I got a new one. Look, it's still spilling it everywhere. I'll turn it off in a wee second. In fact, I'll just turn it off now. Let me just unplug it. Because I don't need that now. That's that done. Okay, so we're on site. We've got a Chinese in work. Tuesday is the 5th of the 6th, 21, um, and I am working again, 8.30 till 8pm, and Tuesday, 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 what am I doing? Do you know what you're thinking? It'll come back to me. Wednesday is the 6th of the 6th, 21, and that is Faith's 27th birthday. Day. So we're going to see her and on Wednesday again I am 8.30 till 8pm. Thursday I will do the planner video and I'll just put in a wee bit to say and make the sticker sheet. Make the sticker sheet. Sunday, I am going to do Sunday with Sam. I'm going to make that my crafting day on my channel. Sunday with Sam. We'll just put YouTube in here. What am I doing this weekend? I can't even think. Um, gosh, it seems that far away. I'm trying to think what's this weekend. Wednesday's fifth birthday. Have I got anything else? So that'll be Tuesday the seventh. Why have I got the seventh the sixth? Why have I got the sixth? The tenth. My god. I thought you guys were all shouting at me there. The tenth. Alright. That's my I think my brain's went into that abyss when my, my other stuff's went in my planner room as well. The seventh, so Friday is the eighth of the 10th, 21, Saturday is the 9th of the 10th, already, hey, that's crazy, and Sunday is the 10th of the 10th, 21, Friday, Saturday, Friday, Friday, Saturday, um, no, can't think of anything else. Is that my Saturday on? I is. Oh, so that's my Saturday on. So that will be, I'll be in. So that's my Saturday on. Saturday at work. And I will be in from 8.30am till 6pm that day. I'm trying to think of anything in particular that I need to do this week. It'll come to me, you know what it's like. I'll, 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 I always fill it in during the week anyway as I go along, but... Oh, Thursday, Thursday, Thursday is my uh, gusto box. Thursday's my gusto box. Wednesday night I need to put the bins out. See, it's coming to me all the wee stuff that I used to do. Wednesday night I need to put the bins out. Um, right, Sunday. Need to make the pack lunches. Make pack lunches. Monday two is Kane's first day in the hub at school. No, can't really think of anything else, guys. It'll come to me, but I always do anyway. It's the next game week I'll show you, like if there's anything specific that I've done or anything else that I got up to. It'll come to me. But yeah, I like that. I think that turned out really nice. I think it really does. And I like writing in the blue because I think it stands it. And I'll do like something on here. Just to, to 
to fancy it up. I might even do something on the front just to fancy it up. But yeah. So this is my first week planner. First week planning. So it's pretty cool. So let me know what you think, guys, of my first week spread. I'm sorry I don't have much to put in it this week. Um, but it will come to me and then I'll show you it next week. All we'll do is we'll put in our wee um, paper clip. You can go in there so you can just see him like that and then I'll grab the planner which fell we'll put it back in I'm definitely going to recover that because I don't know so it's nice it's nice it's pretty but I don't know but I will but anyway we'll put this back in oh look there's this um sheet here that came with it so we'll maybe use that one week as well in fact we will we'll definitely use that one week but that's pretty cool pretty happy with that actually i'm really buzzing can you tell because i really like doing my plan and i'm glad to be back doing it i love it there we go so when you open it up and i like when it fills up because each week you can see all the different spreads so next week we will do those pages so yeah, that is it guys. Talk to me in the comments. Let me know if you do your planning. And um, I will see you all again next Thursday for the next planning with me. Thank you.